The fundamental principle of economics, if you study economics, one of the first things that you learn is a principle about supply and demand. And the principle about supply and demand is essentially the more you increase supply, all things being equal, the more likely you're going to see a price drop. And the corollary is also true, the more you increase demand, the likelihood is all things being equal, you're going to see a price rise. When I make videos and publish them online on my YouTube channel and Facebook and so on, I, I always receive some comments from people asking me about the possibility of a correction or a crash like we had in 2006 or 2007, 2008 after the Celtic Tiger situation. And there's a report today in the Irish Times which confirms that the supply of second-hand properties now in 2024 is 50%, yes, 50% less than it was 10 years ago. And the same report then, what does it say about supply uh, of people rather or demand? It says that the population in Ireland has grown by either 65,000 or 650,000, I can't remember which, every year since 2016. But the fundamental principle is that you have a situation where the supply of second-hand houses has fallen, the number available to purchase has fallen, and yet the population has increased steadily over the last, well, since 2016. And in that scenario, it's very difficult to see how house prices could fall. You need a significant increase in the supply of houses to bring equilibri equilibrium to the market. And until that happens, you're looking at a situation where it will be difficult to see house prices falling or any sort of a correction or crash that is being suggested in some of the comments online. Now, everybody is perfectly entitled to their opinion and everybody is entitled to voice that opinion but I prefer my opinion is based on data and on evidence and some fundamental principles. And one of the principles when it comes to house prices is simply that house prices are a function to a great extent of supply and demand. And until supply increases significantly, it's hard to see house prices falling. Anyway, that's the report in the Irish Times today. Check it out, 50% less houses now than second-hand houses are available now than were available 10 years ago. That's a significant drop. And secondly, the population has increased steadily since 2016. So in those circumstances, it's hard to see, without an increase in supply of houses, how house prices can fall. As I say, everybody's entitled to their opinion. Anyway, I'm down here at the harbour in Enfield. It's a nice day. I think it's the 7th of August, 2024. It's a nice day down here and we can have a look down there now at the boats in the harbour. This is Enfield Harbour. I come down here regularly to make videos and to uh, just get a breath of fresh air and stretch the legs and get out of the office. It's nice to do it. It's a great facility and it's a great credit to a fella, a man called Brian Donoghue, who was uh, the barber in the town. I'm not sure whether he's still working as a barber or not, but he actually used to cut my hair as a young fella. Uh, and that's a while ago, but Brian Donoghue, I think, was the prime moving force in this fantastic development, and it's a real testament to him. Anyway, I hope you liked the video. Uh, if you do, hit the thumbs up down below. Thanks a lot.